The purpose of the tightening and contouring treatments is to generate a high temperature in the dermis and subcutaneous fat. This will trigger different processes in the skin, mainly collagen remodeling and rearrangement of fat cells for circumference and cellulite reduction. For TC treatments, it is very important to apply a sufficient amount of gel to the treatment area, approximately a layer of 2 to 3 millimeters, ensuring a sufficient amount of gel throughout the treatment. If needed, add gel during treatment. Full contact should be maintained between the electrodes on the handpiece and the skin. If the handpiece is not in full contact, the system will automatically stop due to the contact safety sensor. Press the button again to initiate the pass. In addition, the handpiece should be moved in a constant circular motion during the treatment in order to prevent overheating of the skin. If the handpiece is not in motion, the motion safety sensor will prompt a message on the screen telling you to adjust rotation speed. Confirm the message on the screen and continue the treatment. To start treatment, perform two consecutive preheating passes on the treatment area. Then use the IR thermometer, moving it across the treatment area about 5 centimeters from the skin to measure the temperature. Optimal skin temperature is between 40 to 42 degrees Celsius. If a minimum temperature of 40 degrees Celsius was not achieved, increase the energy level. Perform additional 1 to 2 passes and measure again. The preheating passes raise the skin temperature up to the therapeutic level and they are not counted as part of the treatment therapeutic passes. After completing the preheating passes and reaching a skin temperature of at least 40 degrees Celsius, reset the pass counter. Now, perform the therapeutic passes as will be explained in the treatment videos. During the treatment, go back and forth on the line of treatment until the sound stops after 30 seconds. Once the 30 second pass is over, press the trigger button again and continue on to the next pass. Measure skin temperature every two to three passes to make sure the temperature is within the recommended range. The minimal number of therapeutic passes is six for the facial area and 10 to 12 for non-facial areas. If the patient feels that the treatment area is becoming too hot, try the following options. Increase the handpiece movement speed. Add fresh treatment gel. Decrease power. Increase, if possible, the size of the treatment area. This applies mainly for body treatments. If the heat sensation persists or excessive erythema or edema is observed, stop the treatment and move to the adjacent area. For optimal results, maintain high skin temperatures. Make sure to perform all clinical passes in a consecutive manner with minimal to no pauses between each pass. To maximize results, perform additional therapeutic passes in addition to the minimal recommended passes. For detailed information, please refer to the application guide and user manual.